Dear Heavenly Father, this is some awesome country. We ask that you watch over us. We're going to drop down into some nasty stuff. We pray that, Lord, that you keep us safe. Thank you for uh, giving us life. We ask in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Just save your breath. Guys, I just wanted to start this video out with a big thank you to everybody that's watched this series. Um, I know it's a rifle hunt, but I just it's been near and dear to my heart to do this for a long time. And I just want to thank everybody for watching. Um, the editors, Chase and Noah, that put this together have been just awesome, awesome. So on the end of this video, I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to take up too much time. Let's get to the video. But on the end of this video, I am going to actually come back on and I, I want to talk about how this all went down. So guys, enjoy. All else fails, you pull out the brosier. Uh, we got some spotters for us today on the other side of the hill. Thank God, Trevor, Steve, uh, Robbie, Jeff, Dad, Chase. We got them all. So today we're going in hot. So I'm gonna support this a little bit, and uh, so they can see us across there and hopefully spot us a big bull. So we'll see. We got a long hike this morning. Noah and I are going to hike about three miles in and then they're just going to be at glassing points like miles and miles away. That way they can see some of the stuff that we can't see and uh, they're going to kind of be our eyes for us. So let's get going. There he is. Yeah. yeah. He is, you can see his horns on the left. Yeah, that's a big bull. That's a big bull. I think he's big. He's big. His okay. frame's big. Those might be pretty good. Let's get on this knob right down here. I can't get this gun to work, dude. Can't make this stuff up, guys. Uh, Doc and Trevor trying to work through this. If you look right behind me, over my left shoulder, there's a whole bird on that ridge right there, and uh, we can't get a bullet to seat my gun. So I think there's some something in there or something. So we're trying to work through this as there's elk right below us. <laughs> Use it, in, but it try, use, use a different shell. The thing out of the middle of the barrel, but...
know, you'll beat us. It'll take us, it'll take us, you know, an hour or something to get out of here. So you'll beat us by a ways. Four to 500 yards from Jeff's side, we could get from that big bull. Okay, so Jeff has got a bull spotted. It looks like a good bull. He just sent us some video of it. Actually, we have enough service up on top up here. And, um, man, shooter bull. We came clear out here. We saw some down over in the thing. Nothing that we could shoot or nothing that we wanted to shoot. The gun's kind of fouling up, so we got to figure the gun situation out. So we're going to hike out, I think it's two and a half miles back. And I don't know, it's going to take us some hours to get clear back around to where they are. So it's a, it's a shot in the dark, but it's one we got to take. There's nothing out here that we want to shoot yet, so just the roll, just enjoy the ride, enjoy the ride. <laughs> so yeah, we have a bull spotted. See those horns above? That's a giant. Can we get to this ridge right down here and shoot him? Uh, long ways. 1300. I mean, we might be able to. That's a big one, isn't it? We just spotted a bull way. Yeah, he just disappeared way, way over there. You could see his tops. It just, didn't you think he was big? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. The bull's still out. Everything is good. And we just spotted a giant, a giant. But he just fed into the timber. He was in this real narrow patch. Looked like a monster. Ready? I think we'll just pack up and start heading that way just to be on the safe side because Jeff said that bull came back out. Okay. You guys do most of your hunting bulls. Okay. We'll pack up and head that way. Wow, Bill. <laughs> this is the only day you're going to have all of us. You guys are leaving early tomorrow? I have to leave tomorrow. I have to be back tomorrow. So I can do a morning hunt for like three hours in the morning. I haven't looked. Kit, are you here till Sunday, here. Steve? It's supposed to be here till Sunday. Okay. It but is? I'm, but I'm not. Major shift. Major shift. He's right in that gap, Jeff, that we saw him come out in. I got him. You got him? Trent. Trent, I got him right here. He's right against the tree in that little gap. So we got that bull relocated and hopefully we can get down there, get in a position to shoot him. It's uh we got plenty of time, plenty of time, plenty of daylight, so that's good a good thing. We'll just see if he comes out. Oh, dear Heavenly Father, this is some awesome country. We ask that you watch over us. We're gonna drop down into some nasty stuff. We pray that Lord that you keep us safe. Thank you for uh giving us life. We ask in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. amen.
awesome to get up on that shooting position right there. Tech tip 777. It's um, if you're hunting where there's a lot of cattle and you break a big limb, every once in a while you need to go and it'll do. It usually works. Sheep, it's different. You gotta go. That's tech trip 777. We're glassing a spot about the size 15 yards by 20, waiting for him to come out. We saw him twice. <laughs> Dress warm. Carry a lot of puffies. This jacket here makes me look skinny, I know. <laughs> See the black diagonal hole. Just, just, just coming out of the black diagonal hole right there. Yeah. And there's there's two stags on the right of that black diagonal hole. Yeah. Okay. Just coming out from the opening there. Maybe just below it. I need to look. Where's the binoculars? See, see the dead stag? Yeah. Okay. See how it's, there's like a dark spot to the left? Like that dark opening. He's bedded down right there. Okay. So if you go to that dead snag, there's like, okay, see the low one way down here? Yeah. Go straight up, yeah. and you'll see that black spot in the trees. Yeah, he's right, okay, he's right there, bedded down in that opening. I think he's, it's the big one. I just can't see him. I'm on. Okay. I'm on. That's the big bull. I'm on. Um, he's on. He is a white rock. He's just. You want me to shoot him? Are you on him, Steve? He's on him. You want me to shoot him? Are you on him? I'm on him. Shoot him? He's not broadside. He's not broadside. He's turned straight away. You hit him. You hit him. Reload. Think... He's still standing there. He's broadside. Oh, he almost. Stumbling. He's stumbling. He's going down. He's, He's down. He's down. He's down. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the big one? It's, it's the big one. one.
You got it. You got it. Oh, that was freaking epic. You last second of life. Oh. <sighs> Thank you, guys. <laughs> oh, Trent. Good job, buddy. This has been a, this has been a hunt. You smoked that bull. I seen him start to go like this, and then he, he just tumbled. Just rolled down the hill. Down the hill. Good job getting on him. Good job, guys. Thank you. I could not have done this without you guys. I don't know. I don't know how I turned the spotting scope, dude, and he was right in the middle of it. All I look is I saw, all I see is head and horns. I'm like, that's the big one. We did it. <laughs> you did such a good shot, Trent. That was an amazing shot. An amazing shot. <laughs> one and done. <laughs> You're sure, we're all sure it's down. Oh, dude, I watched it. him roll in the roll. I saw him rolling you in the You want to watch him fall down he in the smoke scope? He stumbled. He and then he there. started rolling. Because I couldn't find him again in the scope. <laughs> he, dude, I was like, I, I could tell you hit him, but I didn't know where. But then all of a sudden, I seen his you legs start him, to give, and then he just started rolling. You got him. The, the, the weight lifted off my shoulders right now. Dude, his horns look like this. Dude, did you see his horns? <laughs> I, just, I got him in the phone scope. I was like, that's the big one. We cow called what? Giant. Two times. Yeah, he's a damn. Two he, times, and he giant. steps out. He was right there the whole time, all day. That doesn't fire you up. Came over here. <laughs> Can you hear me? Last minutes of life. Look at that. Just oh, look at the fuck. Just, dude, it was meant to be. <laughs> you can't ask for a better thing. You can't. No, you can't. Late night, baby. My my radio just quit. His radio's dead. Radio the other one. Okay. Well, I got another one. <laughs> I'm shivering. And I shut it off. Too. Oh my so gosh. Full charge. Oh wait, please tell me it got it all. Okay, full charge. I shut this one off. Okay. We just killed that big bull. Dude, he is wide. Dude, he's wide. This is when I was running. We just shot him right at last light and watched him fall. He, he, we we got him, guys. Can't thank you guys enough. Dude, he looks freaking. Look at the ivory. I told you he was huge, Trevor. He's a beautiful bull, man. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we're out here. We're fogged in and. Uh, just last light and we just got a word on the radio that Trent just killed a big bull and we are pumped <laughs> we've been completely fucked up here man oh wow pretty cool pretty I cool. am pumped I'm gonna I might just run down that hill and grab half that elk and just yank it right out of there right now and then right there he's flopping that's a dead bull <laughs> that's a dead elk and it's a big one it's a dog <laughs> He's like giant. It's a big one. I couldn't believe I found him in the phone scope. I, you did that awesome. was pure luck, dude. You did awesome. Oh. He even followed him down the hill. <laughs> I am shaking. I think he's dead. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Yeah. Dude, he was rolling. He only lived for he, not long. Yeah. 17, 18 years. He just killed the biggest bull. I just killed the, the biggest bull. Congratulations, buddy. <laughs> Congratulations, man. That was awesome. That was awesome. Oh man, and, oh. and it was like the whole team came. It, I mean, we couldn't have done it without them. We could not. I couldn't have done this without you guys because it would have been like it, it couldn't have happened. It sucked you know? had it, had, had it, you hadn't gotten one yet, but I was kind of glad you didn't. So at least I got to come over and at least hunt for two days. <laughs> <laughs> one day, one day, a day and a half. But oh. Dude, he is down. He went down. Oh, he, he went down, down hard. I think he's right in that draw. I think you, I think you're right. I think I got way because I never right. and the fog, Greg. Right? Right after it was closing time, the fog moved in right out. It was just, we said a prayer, said a prayer on that landing, and it happened. It did. Oh, man. Last night, no lie, I woke up about 12.30, because I have to go to the bathroom, and uh, put some wood in the fire, and I got back in bed, and laying there in the cot, and, and uh, I couldn't go back to sleep. and. Every once in a while, it just really bothered me. I said, hey, Trent, Trent's getting antsy, and his sights were set up pretty high. But, and I know the feeling, you know, everybody's counting on you, but uh, I did. I, I thought, you know, we need to get together, have prayer, and if it's meant to be, we're going to get a bull on the ground before the snow hits, because... God is good. That's all I can say.
We are truly blessed. Dude, it was epic. It was truly epic. Trent just made an absolute amazing shot. We did it. Day 11. Seven minutes oh. left of shooting light. Way to go, guys. <laughs> I gotta give this guy a hug. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We did it. Congratulations. <laughs> it's a monster. It looks like it. Great job. It's a big one. Oh, so. I just saw a yeah, white. Thank so much, Roy. Happy birthday, man. Thank you. So, uh, Thank you guys so much for coming. Oh, so good. <laughs> that was man. It was exactly what we thought it was going to be. Uh, the last man, you couldn't do this without all these guys. It's been pretty awesome to have brothers and dads. and. Friends, new friends. How many dads do you have? All of them. Yeah, it's been awesome. Pretty proud of you. <laughs> Look how wide he is. <laughs> he's a good boy. He's a real one. He's wide. His fronts, thirds. Okay, we got to all the troops here at drop in from the other side of where you saw us shot, shoot him from. So, shouldn't be a terrible pack, I don't think. Ish, ish. We're gonna, we're gonna make a day of it. Oh, it's so nice having the people here. little knob and just go straight down that might not be terrible yeah. we're halfway there we're a mile in maybe something like that we're halfway there but then now we got a drop serious elevation so that uh, won't be too bad one night right one night In one of these opening. little tiny openings up here, and he rolled down into the draw. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can smell him. You see him right there? We can be we can be truthful. You just killed the biggest bull of your wife. <laughs> Where? He's right there. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job, Noah. Let us right turn. Oh, there's horns. I see something. I see some There's pines. fronts I can see from right here. Oh. oh Steve and Trevor, get up there. Thank you, honey. Oh, yeah. That's a big bull. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the big bull. He's He's a a big bull. bull. <laughs> oh, look at that thing. Gosh. Trent. That is giant. That is a stuff. He is bigger than giant. what we thought. Look at the look at that. Oh my god. Look at that. <laughs> is that a big one? That's a big one, buddy. <laughs> that is a big bull. <laughs> Yeah, look, look at the, that was the oh, first thing I looked at. Look how wide. When you look asked me, Trevor, is he the big one? Look how big that yeah. elk is. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Nice spot this morning, man. Oh, Robbie, Robbie. Oh, my Robbie. God. Whoever Robbie, you guys. <laughs> look at the body on that <laughs> thing. That's a big thing. That is a huge, look at the yes. front, dude. Trent, 
I'm gonna get that was it. Like, wow, man. Jeez. That third trend is what I first saw when oh. Trevor asked me if it's the big one. Look, look how white he is. Oh, that, <laughs> dude, look at the full. Dude, that width is ridiculous. That is insane, Trent. Go get him rolling, Trent. Oh, <laughs> look at that thing, dude. Oh, my God. Look at the body on him. Dude, he's a brute. That is a big elf. Save That's the neck for look me. At look at the go. whale tail. Oh look at that horn. Oh, my gosh. What? That's <laughs> a dream. That is a dream. Trent, we're caping it. No, Ooh. we're not. <laughs> That's a stud, dude. Oh, Beautiful. This execution. hunt has been something else, man. This hunt has been something else. Look at that haunchy. That's a big elf. That is a big elf. <laughs> That's a big one. You got what you came for. You got what you came for, dude. <laughs> we got it, guys. I couldn't have done it. We all did it. He's in a great spot. We all did it. That's... Proud I Papa. That these, I mean, these are so big around. Pretty cool. I knew he had good mass, but man, I mean, just the thickness of his tines are... That's insane. Really impressive. Yeah. It's... He's that is a, he's, that's a he's big... He's wider than I thought, too. Oh, yeah, he's definitely wider. And I knew he was wider. Trent, you killed the guy. You killed us. Yes. You killed him. An absolute, I think he's bigger than we think. Let's see this side. Oh my goodness, look at that. Man, that thing is just, oh, we got yeah. look at that. Is it all webbed out back? Oh, look how big that is. Look at how webbed out it is. Oh my God. Ooh, it looks like he might have damaged that in velvet. Whoa, that is cool. That is cool, That main beam is huge. Yeah, it's all it's all about Lift here. that up again. Dude, that bull is huge. That is, dude, that is a... That bull is a walrus. <laughs> That's not a skull cap, dude. That's a no. skull cap. Yeah, is dude. he 390? No. no. He's a skull cap, dude. <laughs> he's giant. Dude, he's, he's giant. He's giant. He looked like he had short main beams the because he's five feet back. wide. Are, yes. <laughs> That's why it looks so short because he's so wide, those main beams. These are the ones you see in Sportsman's Warehouse right here. Cabela's <laughs> yeah. right here. My yeah. barn right Those here. ones you look up and see, and see and see like... <laughs> So nice to have help, man. This is this would have been just with just me and dad and Noah and you. It would have been a it would have been a two-day adventure and as it is, we're only been I think it took us a couple hours and stuff once we took some photos and stuff and to get him whacked up and man, can't say enough for these guys just to come out here and help me do this is pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. <laughs> Pretty nice bull, I shot it, as Trent would say. How big's that tailgate? That is impressive. I know. Oh, cramped up again. All right, here you go. Oh, I can't. I gotta walk. <laughs> How, where, are we at? where are we at with this, bud? Uh, scale one to ten? Yeah. Four. 
Nine. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a hug. We do this every pack out. Thank you guys so much. Love you, man. Love you too. Thank you guys. I'm gonna miss it. Thank you. Robbie, oh, love you, bud. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we did it. We oh, did yeah, it. We did. Come here, oh, buddy. Oh. Yeah. We'll get him back there. Yeah. Yeah. Dave, let me hug. Thank you. That was awesome. That was awesome. Yeah. So much, brother. Thank you. Uh, well, guys, that's it. The big tag is over. The stress, the uh, <laughs> anxiety, all of that that comes with it is uh, over. And it feels really good. I'm not going to lie to you. But um, hope you guys love this one. Uh, it's, been a, it's been a day that I'll never forget. I promise you that. So thanks all these guys for being here. It's, uh, yeah, I don't have words. Yeah. I've been holding this for you. <laughs> it's a blood orange. Wow. So I said I'd come on here at the end. And, uh, guys, I just want to just thank everybody, everybody for watching. This has just been an unbelievable series that uh, it, it follows an unbelievable hunt. It was so awesome to be able to do that. And um, I just wanted to come on here and talk about the rifle game versus the bow game. You haven't seen me hunt for a couple years with a bow and arrow and that's because I just kind of wanted something something different um, than the normal than the normal bow hunt and don't get me wrong I love going out and bow hunting it is one of the funnest things that I do it is to see somebody take their first animal or their 21st animal and be able to help them and call for them and stuff like that it is so awesome it is so awesome so don't don't think I'm down, down playing on any of that I just wanted something different for myself this year I've been practicing with a gun for the last I don't know three years or so and SIG has been so awesome at providing a lot of stuff for us that way we could practice and shoot stuff and some ammo and stuff like that and getting proficient in shooting and um, I just wanted a different hunt this for this for this big tag that I had and that's, that's why I chose rifle and um, anyway for you guys to watch it is just man it just fills my heart with joy but this is the bull. This is the bull I killed, and and um, anyway, it was just. Uh, it, it, I said this is the bull I killed. I promise I won't ever try to do that again. This is the bull that we killed. This was not me that killed this elk. I could never have done this without the help of uh, my brother, my dad. Uh, Chase, who's behind the camera right now, Noah, who's behind the camera and editing this video that you guys just watched, um, Jeff, Robbie, Cody, I mean, all these people that poured their Steve, he came up and all these people came up and helped me on this elk. And I could not, this is not my elk. This is, it's not at all my elk. It's their elk. It's our elk. And, um, which is so cool to me. So it just goes back to the whole, you on a normal hunt that we normally do it's you got a caller you got a, a cameraman and you've got a shooter and my <laughs> in my sense on this hunt it was you've got a shooter and you've got a plethora up to eight guys spotting for you and rooting for you and also a cameraman too chase and noah and it's it just like it was unbelievable what they would give up to come back Trevor gave up the last weekend if you don't know what that means that's the best weekend to hunt blacktails the rut is what it's called anyway he gave that up to come help me out and he also brought Jeff and Robbie with him and then Steve showed up as well Steve said I'm coming I'm coming hot and so anyway that it was just the way it all turned out the way it all ended was amazing it was just I mean it was super super special for me but um it, it just it just goes to show like we're still doesn't matter what we're shooting it doesn't matter if it's a bow or if it's a gun or if it's a crossbow or if it's a slingshot we're all gonna want the guy whoever has the paperwork the tag in his pocket to succeed and um anyway this is uh this was pretty awesome so i'm going to try to jump on here guys and try to answer as many questions that i can um 
if you want to write down a question down below. Again, I just thank everybody. Um, this bull, the first question is going to be, what's it score? This bull, I had Dan score this bull. It scores 350 and an eighth. So that's what it scores. It's a giant trophy to me. Um, anyway, I just thank you everybody for watching. And again, I'm going to try to answer as many questions as I can, but just just thank you guys. And next week, I promise you, the episode is going to be awesome. So please, please watch next Monday. Thank you guys so much.